What's going on guys? I'm Outdoors coming back to another banger video. Today we got Bob KB Bryce. We're doing a little competition today. It's me and Bob versus Bryce and KB. We're seeing who can shoot the most squirrels. The rules in the scoring goes box squirrels and gray squirrels as two points. Red squirrels is one point. Black and albino is three. Person to score the most points wins. We're gonna see who can do the most. We're gonna split up here. Hopefully we kill some squirrels. We just watched Bryce and KB down a little red squirrel, so they're already on the board with one. We got a pretty good spot, though. I got a good feeling about it. Walking along the edge here. They got to come out to eat eventually. And we'll be here waiting for them. I can hear them. Look in the trees. See them? Yeah, I don't see them anywhere. Come on, let's keep going. Oh, big squirrel. No, oh, I definitely hit him. Where'd he go, though? Right there. Got him. Let's go, Bob. Big fox squirrel. Check this out, guys. <laughs> Bryce. What? That little dinky thing. We gotta go find some more. We got an hour left, probably. We're gonna go find some more squirrels. KB just got gray squirrels, so now the score is three, two, two. That's what I want. You get him? Come on. No. I know. So many squirrels. We should have three more. Oh my gosh, we missed another one. We're literally right on them too. Just don't get it. Missed another, what can you do? It's definitely a squirrel. I think I just seen him on the back side of this tree. Bye, watch this dead tree. Oh, he's right here, up on this tree. Right there, on the, in the oak tree. Oh, yeah. Right? Bobby, keep an eye on him. Where'd he go? He's on that same tree, right side. Oh yeah, he was just running like a bat out of hell. God, we just choked hard. Little red squirrel. I think it's about game, boys. I think we took an L. Well, me and Bob lost. We fought a very hard fight, that's for sure, huh, Bob? Yeah, we choked so hard. I think we missed like three fox squirrels. We rolled one, that should have been dead. The old mix bag. <laughs> Check them out. Old daddy there. Little tiny. You guys shouldn't even won. This should count as three, big girl. It still counts as three. Look at the nuts on that thing. Zoom in on that. Get that on there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we choked hard. We lost. Three to two. How many squirrels did you guys shoot at? Just uh, those two? Yeah. And that last one. So they only missed one squirrel. We missed four. three. Yeah, four fox squirrels. We shot at three. That one we hit. I think we hit, but we And there was two in the field. We couldn't even see those. I was going to shoot a chipmunk too. There's a chipmunk running. It was like three feet in front of me. I would have blown it up. We're going to do a little catch and cook on these. So stay tuned for that. It's going to get greasy. Got these squirrels back. I already cut the tails off. My girlfriend likes them for uh, making little cat deals. I'm not sure what she does with them cat toys. I already did the red squirrel here. This is all the meat. Not very much. That's why you don't shoot at red squirrels. But 
There's a pity one for these boys. I'm gonna show you how to clean these things. You make a little slit down the back. Open her up. All right, and you just pull her open like this. Don't look like you just hit in the head, KB. All right, there you go. That's what you're left with. And cut that right at the knuckle. Cut through the tendons. Break the bone if I can. There we go. Okay, do the same the other side. As so, that can get thrown in the bucket. Flip her over. Cut at the knuckle. Pop her open, you'll see that little joint there. And you just carve right around it. Just like that. You got a piece of lovely little chicken meat there. These are all right. I mean, the fox squirrels are bigger than these gray squirrels. So if you were going out for meat, I'd definitely shoot at the fox squirrels before you shot the gray ones, if you were to go. Break that, cut that all the way through. Find this joint, same deal. Little disc, cut right around that. Pull her through, boom. There's your front shoulder. Pop that off. <coughs> KB's got COVID. Two front shoulders, should we take the back meat? Oh yeah, KB's saying, oh yeah. All right, you just find the inside of the rib cage here. Pop that open. Pull out all those guts so you don't hit them. Then you come right up here. Just twist that. Break that. Cut it all the way through. There you go. Nice little butterfly chop there. There's your back. That's how you properly clean a squirrel. Then you take them over to your cold ice bath. Right here. Let her soak for a little bit. Get all that blood out. Then we're gonna take them outside, clean them, and cook them for you guys. Stay tuned. Let's check out the back on this red squirrel. The old chicken nugget from McDonald's. <laughs> Drop her in. Get the whole works in. Oh yeah. We got the butterflies on the back. Flour, really? Who puts flour in there? There go. Yeah. Check that out, huh? We better start seasoning, huh? Yeah. Supposed to season the butter. It actually smells pretty good, huh? Get that butter all around them. Oh! Mmm! It smells oh, delicious. Yeah. We're gonna let you know when she's done. Let's look at it. Looks like a frog <laughs> We got our squirrel here. Look at how inbred that. Crap looks. Is that the leg right there? That thing's tiny. Yeah, the red squirrel. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna take my first little bite here. Poor thing. Oh, it actually tastes like chicken. I'm not. <laughs> I am not even joking right now. It actually tastes like chicken. You're okay, bold. The stuff's good. Stick of butter, a little garlic powder, a little lorries. Mmm, here. Excuse me, lunch down. Yeah, I got some hair too. Look at that. <laughs> Something floss with you that. just eat right through it. You guys enjoy this video. Smash the like button. Hit the subscribe button. Don't get stabbed, people. And we'll see you on the next one. We all peace.